and uh, stadium and that's just going through his things as the two sides come out to a warm round of applause from both sets of fans here Slough in their amber and blue Gainsborough in their light blue it's the holy blues versus the rebels and we are a couple of seconds away from the kickoff hopefully there's the The players did just uh, go through the handshakes here. A couple of the games where players have brought on some little babies for the game. Not like substitutes, just brought babies on for the occasion. Obviously, don't get too too excited there. And uh, the atmosphere here at Northheim home of games for Trinity is absolutely rocking. Last for a cap come to the injured Slough players are uh, coming up and it is the kickoff. Slough started on the far hand side looking for Dodson it's headed away though free kick from Turner to come in Turner aiming quickly here for Flood Flood up against Clark it comes through here to Harris beaten to the ball by the left back come through into the box Williams tries to get there but the goalkeeper Ravis comes out well ball up well finds Togwell Togwell with the ball forward trying to find the run of uh, Dodson Dodson's continued his run can burst down the box just cuts back inside still has the ball he's got Williams here with him oh Williams goes past can he get to the ball first he gets there's a great save by Ravis and in the end it's hooked clear and there's a foul there by Dobson on Lacey and Warren Harris first time that Warren Harris has got into the game plays it down the right looking over the ball on top oh Williams is almost in there and Lacey has to come across Williams has closed it down the ball just finds kindly for Lacey he can hook the ball clear and uh, a long ball for it's going to put Slough under a bit of pressure well this is there first but it's come through to Warshold finds Jarman Jarman shoots but it's well wide and it's actually been deflected it's going to be a corner Taylor has the ball has time on the ball here, plays it in towards Clark. Clark looks up, chipping the ball into the box. It's over the head of everyone and goes all the way out of play and out for a goal kick. Puts the ball up well, it's got Lynch in attendance. Lynch comes in, Lynch has Nathan Smart. Smart can get across in first time. Whips it in first time, Williams with a header and Rava saves and catches it at the second attempt. Southampton through down to 10 men while floods off the pitch. It's going to be George Wells to take the throw, finds Togwell back towards Wells. Wells hits it straight at that and it hits a it hits Super Kev accidentally and King apologises straight away but uh, Super Kev made of sterner stuff and it's another throw for South, same position, George Wells on the far hand side, roughly off inside the gains for a half, he's looking for a bit of movement, trying to find Flood, Flood holding the ball up well, finds Lynch, Lynch tries to get into the penalty area, still running with the ball, still Matt Lynch, shows it in, Slough has scored, Matt Lynch from 8 yards out, he gives Slough in 34 minutes, he ghosted into the box, he evaded a couple of challenges and then he just slides it past the goalkeeper and Slough are temporarily down to 10 men and one of the most happiest people is Alan Inns I don't think I've seen Alan Inns move that fast trying to find Flood, Flood trying to sweep it into the path of Dobson Dobson controls it inside the centre circle, back in towards Flood Flood looks up, shoots from distance, oh it's wide of the goal there but uh, Flood tries his luck, just couldn't execute it and it's taken by Dobson, goes to the far post and this bit's unmarked, volleys it across goal oh and it needed a touch from Williams or Lynch, they couldn't get one it's gone wide of the goal but that's a good effort for the Rebels three minutes of added time here for this first half ball play forward, looking for the run of Dobson, laces underneath it oh plays it back short to Dobson Dobson goes round, he tries to get in there it's come off the goalkeeper, it's a corner poor by Lacey, he really didn't look to see where Dobson was here towards Togwa, Here's the ball kicked forwards here by uh, Lacey trying to find Worsfold. Worsfold in the corner up against gets a cross in ball comes through Turner tries to go for it comes through to Jarman Jarman forced wide by Warren Harris of all people back here towards Taylor Taylor chips it into the box hooked clear by Nisbet not the best of clearances it'll come out towards King no it won't because it's the half time whistle here at North Holm and uh, I could just see that John Under was being called over by the cameras to do his little talk but you can, I don't know if you can pick it up but the noise coming from the Slough fans on that far hand side is brilliant and they've been singing all game this goalkeeper <coughs> and first Dobson he's got an open goal to choose if he wants to find Flood Flood back into it Dobson takes it gets tackled ball comes out here towards Lynch shoots goal what a goal by Matt Lynch this is from the edge of the area it's an absolute screamer oh my word nothing gone He's just put that into the top corner 
What a stunning goal! Matty Lynch with his second of the game. It's an absolute call. Be careful. King plays the ball here, looking for the run of Davy on the far hand side. Nathan Swart always giving the ball away. Davy's trying to run through. Gets through into the box. Davy goes down and games will go mad. They think that that should have been a penalty. Underneath it is Clark. Only as far as Togwell. Togwell just plays it forward, looking for uh, Chris Flood. Flood up against Stainfield. Foul. Stoke Flood trying to get there, comes through to Williams. Oh, Williams skips past the challenge, gets into the box, finds Flood, and it's in! It's free! So good a third! The goal comes from Chris Flood! Williams with the ball, he got into the box, he skipped the challenge! He got all the fans, the players have run into the corner, it's gone mad! Down that near hand side. Williams with the ball, he played it in! It just broke lightly to Flood as he stretched, he guided it past! The outcoming Ravas! And it's going to be Matt Lynch to take this free kick for Slough. Halfway inside the game for Trinity Half. Lynch chips it in looking for Flood. Williams! It's all it's just wide on the goal. Flood gets there in front, just gets a flick onto it. Just goes the wrong side of the post for the Rebels. This is the best. It'll come out here towards Lynch. Score a two goal. Oh, Lynch gives the ball away to King and it's picked up here by Simmons. Plays it down to King down this near hand side. Chip to the far post. And it's just gone, it's hit the top of the crossbar and gone out of play for a goal kick there. The cross from Craig King. Specialist of uh, Josh Lacey. Throws the ball into the box. It's fixed on well. Comes all the way across goal. And uh, Turner slides in to clear with his feet in the end. Stopping it going for corner. He's actually cleared the stand. It's gone into the, the road down the side there. Something 79. Listen. Snow had the ball with Williams. Trying to find Dobson. Dobson's got a bit of space here for Snow. Edge of the box. He's played it across the goal. And wide of the goal, it was a good chance for the Rebels. In swinging corner here for Craig King. Takes it and uh, Turner punches away. Comes to Simmons. Simmons shoots. Turner blocks with his feet. Hooks away though by Snell. Comes out here towards Davey. Dobson, Dobson trying to play his way through. Richards has won it back here for Gainsbury. He's hit it straight at uh, Togba. Ball hits Flood. Gives it to Togba. Back in towards Williams. Williams inside the penalty area. It's four! Snell have got a fourth! It's Manny Manny Williams with the goal. Someone's even thrown their hat on the pitch. Oh my word, even, even Bakes and Unders have gone in and joined the celebration. And it's a throw on. It's headed away by Tugwell for Sal to Jacqueline. Jacqueline's headed to Tugwell. Biff, head tennis finds Flood. Flood, he has the ball. Cuts inside against Stanfield. Goes into the box. Finds Dobson, shoots first time, it's just gone right, it's time, it's five! You will never guess! You will never guess who scored! It's Sean Fraser! Oh my word, he's not going to score! An easier goal, Sean Fraser from about a yard, Al Dobson with the shot, saved by Ravas, and Sean Fraser of all people! Um, Sean Fraser's mum uh, is dancing around the kitchen. I think she's going to be having a few gin and tonics tonight. Ball's here with uh, Chris Flood trying to release Gavin James. Gavin James trying to get to for on the side. It's up against it. It shoots, but it's blocked and it's going through. Malua, Malua Ladder. I don't know how to spell that's the name. I'm really sorry. So it's, uh, they should have shown us live on TV. Um, so now have the ball on the far hand side with Fraser. In towards Lynch for his hatching. Six goals! Lynch has scored two hat tricks! In two games, it's six to the Rebels. The ball was played in. And Slough are going go crazy in the FA Cup. Matt Lynch has scored two hat-tricks in two cup games. It's games run ill. Free kick, 40 yards to both a goal. Chips the ball into the box. Bounces around, just shooting red. It's a shot, what a save by Turner! Oh my word, a save from Bradley Wells, what a save! Ball still bouncing around in the box, Guy Hollis is over in the corner. Guy Hollis will clear the ball down the field. That is a stunning save from the Jack Turner from Bradley Wells from about 12 yards in the box. Comes through to Lynch, Lynch will turn and hook the ball down the field. Only as far as Davy. Davy's touch comes into Worsfield. Westwood plays a lovely little ball in here towards Sharma. Plays it across. Turner at full strength again. Trinity, can they get a goal back? King plays the ball into the box. Wells for Snell. Heads it away. Comes out to 
Uh, Lynch, Lynch running with the ball. He's got Gavin James in front of him if he needs him. Lynch still running with the ball. He's got on the far side, Chris Flood. Tackle comes in. Comes across to Lowe Smart. Smart plays it in on the far hand side. Into uh, Flood. Flood plays it back in towards Smart. Continued his run. Finds Gavin James. James goes down. The linesman has indicated it's a penalty to Slough. Slough got a penalty in the last minutes for a foul on Gavin James. James with the penalty. The referee just making sure everyone's out. James comes out, shoots. Oh, he's put it wide of the goal. Gavin James has missed the penalty. He's put it wide of the goal. Goalkeeper went the wrong way. At the end of the day, we don't actually care. Because it's 6-0, the end of the game. Um, Rob Stevens is going to run and interview the match. It's a full time whistle here at Gainsborough Trinity. It's finished. Gainsborough Trinity nil. Slough Town 6 is the score. A huge thank you to everyone. The Slough fans are making a stunning bit of noise in that far left hand side. It's good sportsmanship from both sets of players. The Rob should go on to this. The Slough players just going over to the fans. Uh, Ledi, I can't commit his name, sorry mate. Stephen Roach, Sam Weisler, Ryan Harris, Will Reese. Um, I, I did get this thing to go up. The Slough players are just doing a dive in front of the Slough fans. And the celebrations will go on for ages. <laughs>